Hello and welcome to another tutorial here. Today I'll be talking about OpenVPN and how to set it up on a droplet. Okay, I'm just going to go ahead and actually create a new server for this. Uh, it's not that big of a deal. I'm going to name this OpenVPN. It seems like what I'm doing for every um, tutorial is just making a new server so, um, so we do not run into any issues with pre-existing stuff. So I'm going to use Ubuntu 12.04 is 64-bit and I'm going to use a SSH key that I have and I'm going to go ahead and create this droplet. So while this droplet is creating, I am going to go into PuTTY, close out of that, and I'm going to open this up and go here and load this. I can change a couple settings while this is creating that. Okay, that's fine, and I need to change the IP address. Okay, three more seconds. Alrighty, and I have an IP address. So I'm going to put that in there and save that. And open. Alright, so yes. Alright, now that we are using this a 64-bit version, um, we can go ahead and start by using the 64-bit installer. So like so, and it has been installed, and now we're going to start OpenVPN, or install it if you will. And these commands will be in the description, and I will try to remember, but it seems like I always forget. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and set a password for these uh, OpenVPN user, so OpenVPN. Okay, I'm going to set this password. Okay, password is updated successfully. I'm going to navigate to this in my browser. Not the admin though. Um, the default. Alright, so it's going to be HTTPS. Make sure you remember that because if you don't have that, it will not work. So, uh, 162.243.39.21. Alright, I'm going to proceed. The username is going to be the open VPN user. And the password is going to be what I just said. Alright, I'm going to go press go. And now we're going to click here to download the open VPN client. We're going to wait a couple seconds here. Let this download finish. Okay, I'm going to open that up and press yes. Alright, just waiting. Okay, and now we see now we see we can go to or connect to. So I'm gonna try connecting with a username is open VPN and a password of whatever I selected and press connect. And I am going to allow VPN connection to that using unverified profile. Yes. Let me put this back down here. It's assigning a VPN IP address. And we have been successfully connected to this server. So let's go ahead and go to. And we have been connected. So um, there are a couple things you can do. You can create another user account for um, this. So what I'm saying is, I mean, you can create another account for here. Um, 
inside of this control panel. So let's go ahead and go over to admin so I can show you exactly what I mean. And we can put in a username of the open VPN and then the password of what you selected inside of Ubuntu. And sign in and agree. And then you can create another user here too. So we can go um, to user permissions, here it is. And you can go ahead and create another user and log in using that user. Uh, right now the li license is only two users. Um, I'm not sure how many um, licenses you can have. I really haven't really messed around with OpenVPN. So that's up to them. I don't, I think I've seen somewhere you can get free ones. I'm not sure about that. I mean, it says free license there at the end. So I'm not sure if this is free or how much this is. Um, let's go ahead and go to pricing. See, so, yeah, I'm not too sure. All open VPN access servers downloads come with two free uh, things in for that. So uh, that's about it. Um, it works out really well. Everything seems to be fine. Um, I am going to go to um, um, what is my IP and see if I do have a different IP address right now. I should. Yes, I do. I do have. I have the IP address of my server, which shows I'm in the New York City right now, which is kind of cool. So um, that's good. That's what we wanted to happen um, because we don't want we don't want to see our normal IP. That's what I'm getting to. Um, so if you type in what is my IP in Google, we'll also give you IP too. If you did not know that, no, nope, it's right there, and that's not actually right. That one there, you can go through proxies because that is my normal IP address. And if I go to like a what is my IP website, it shows the correct one. And it's saying there's no proxy. That's a little interesting why uh, Google's is showing my, actually my public one. Let's see. All right. Well, thank you for go hang in watching this tutorial. Um, I am glad I could help you install this. Everything seems to be working as it should, and that's about it. Okay, um, the next one will be on PTPP, which is another kind of open VPN client connection, uh, similar. Okay, well, thank you for watching, and I will have all these commands that I use at the end of the tutorial, or in the description, actually. So if you're trying to find them, go ahead and look there. Okay, thanks, and have a great day.